Hello friends, today we are going to study about how to draw a frequency polygon. So you, if you had not subscribed to my channel up till now, please subscribe to my channel so that I can bring more such videos for you. Now, how to draw or construct a frequency polygon? Class is given to you, frequency is given to you. The same sum I had drawn or the same class and frequency I had represent in my previous video of how to construct a histogram the same class and frequency so we come to know that from this data we can construct a histogram also and we can construct a frequency polygon when classes and frequencies are given to you so what we have to do as we what we were doing in histogram the same thing first we have to do that we have to draw x-axis I'm drawing it with pen you have to use pencil only I am using pen because look here you will get it a little bit lighter with pencil you will not able to see what I am doing it so I am using pen you have to use pencil keep in mind that this is our y axis you can say y axis and this will be our x axis and this point is called origin now one by one we have to represent this class here but here for frequency polygon first we have to extend one class in the front section and after this also we have to add one class why we are adding that i will tell you later so here 50 to 60 was there so first we will start with 40 so but where are 10 20 30 from this is 0 so first we have to make a zigzag sign or spring so that 10 20 30 will come inside this now we have to start with 40 50 60 70 80 90 100 110 and this is 120 why we are doing this that I will tell you at the last so you keep in mind and now look at the frequency the highest is 8 so if we will take gap of 1 2 then it's okay but never try to take gap of 4 or 8 like that because we have to take multiple or so, multiple of 10 or factors of 10 only we can take here in one box 10 are there so either we, we can take gap of 1 or 2 or 5 or 10 or 20 like that we cannot take gap of 3 directly or 4 so we are here the frequencies are very less so we will take 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and 8 you can see this now for histogram we were drawing bars from 50 to 60 what we were doing here to here and then we were drawing a line and then coming back to here but here we don't have to draw line this is frequency polygon so it is made up of only line segments just we have to put a point on number 3 50 to 60 so this is our line but we don't have to draw a line for this 50 to 60 just we have to put a point on the midpoint look here and drawing imaginary line I am doing it so that you come to know from the midpoint you have to draw a point from midpoint of 60 to 70 now we have to take frequency 5 look here 60 to 70 is 5 so from the midpoint I am drawing it on 5 then 7 from the midpoint of 70 to 80 7 and then 80 to 90 from the midpoint again we will reach at point 8 look here 8 now 4, 90 to 100, so here it will come 4 and here fifth, from 100 to 10, 2 is there. Now we have to join this point, but we don't have a starting and ending point. So I told you in the beginning we are taking 2 in front also we are taking and at last also we are taking one more class. Why? For the starting and ending point, we have to take the midpoint of this 40 to 50 as the starting point and 110 to 120 as the ending point look here. now we will start with here you have to draw it with scale I am not using it here look here 
then you have to go down this way we can construct a frequency polygon if two if we want to compare any two chart then also we can draw one with dark hand and again we can make another class frequency on this graph also and we can compare that also thank you so much for watching my video if you like it please subscribe to my channel so that i can bring more such videos thank you so much